Hello, everybody. DTX720 here, and we are back playing more Pokemon Sword. Don't mind my Xbox turning on in the background for some unknown reason. Freaking weird ass Xbox One likes to turn on for some reason. We're going to start off this episode by quickly flying over to uh, this little place over here because we're going to go. Uh, what am I doing? No. No. Stop. <clears throat> okay. I don't know what it's doing. I didn't want to connect to the internet, but okay. We're gonna fly over to uh, to a little place, and we're gonna we're gonna do the little Galarian Slowpoke event. I'll see you guys there in just one second. Alrighty, guys, we are back. We took a quick little second to heal up our Pokemon, look at them, and uh, and yeah, we taught we taught Toxel and uh, Dreadnought and a couple of the Pokemon. We learned them a little bit new moves, but we'll get into that a little bit later. But we're right here in front of Wedgehurst Station. We're gonna go in here. I'm recording this episode fresh off of the back of the announcement of the Pokemon Sword and Shield Expansion Pass. The train to the Isle of Armor has arrived. Those with an armor pass, please board the train. Look, it's that one girl. Oh, it's Clara. She is so damn cute. Do you have an armor pass? Hehe, <laughs> of course. I totally have one. Please allow me to check your pass. That wasn't the right voice. Oh, there he is. Oh, look who it is. Slow. Oh, a slowpoke. Oh, look. Like another Pokemon has gotten onto the train and ridden over from the Isle of Armor. This little bastard. Guys, um, Slowpoke? Slow? What's going on, bruh? What are you doing? You're a Pokemon trainer, right? No. If Slowpokes blocks the ticket gate, it causes trouble for the other customers. Slowpokes are actually pretty heavy. So do you think you can catch it for me? Slow. Yeah. Let's freaking catch a Galarian Slowpoke. Yeah! Tuxel! Everybody, you guys are gonna be able to see right now that, uh... You guys are gonna be able to see right now, look, uh, Toxel has, uh, Bloom Burst now, which is a great move. But he's only level 13, so I believe we should be able to just throw a, um, Ultra Ball at it, and it should stay in there, depending on how crazy its catch rate is. But look at that little, uh, pink and yellow little sucker, he's pretty cute. The only thing I don't know is what type is uh, Glarian Slowpoke? Is he just a psychic type? I have a feeling that his evolutions, they didn't show us to us yet, but they showed us like little snippet pictures with like the yellow turning purple on the slow, blur slow burrow and slow king. We're gonna send you a. Uh... Let me, let's look at your summary. Let's, let's give everybody the, the gratitude of seeing this guy right here. Look at you. You're ugly gluttony. Okay. Look at him. Confusion, yawn, acid. Yeah, I think he might evolve into a poison type. Look at that. He has the move acid learned by... What type are you? You're just a psychic type right now. Interesting. We're gonna send him to the box. So he can't evolve yet. Um, you can't evolve him yet until you uh, get the buy the expansion pass and get an item from either the Isle of Armor or the Crown Tundra. Thank you so much. The Slowpoke. The Slowpoke is big trouble. Where is he? Wow! Amazing. The way you cut that Slowpoke was absolutely coolest. Oh, you want? Uh, Kind of in a thing with Sonya right now, but uh, if you wanna, if you wanna call me, you are, you are free to. Okay. Clara is so cute, man. Like, god damn it, she's so cute. I'm heading to a place called the Isle of Armor. I'm gonna catch some rare Pokemon and do some training. Let's hang if we meet up again, okay? Bye then. See ya. Bye till then, see ya. That's what, that's what I meant to say. Well, there she goes. Clara's getting on the train, and 
on her way. It's funny, she actually didn't even tell us her name just then. Well, we've caught ourselves a, uh, a Galarian Slowpoke. We did that whole little event. Now let us continue on with our story. Alrighty, guys, we're back on Route 9 where we left off. Let me turn off this internet thing. I just don't want to see a bunch of people's icons on my screen right now. Alrighty. Let us continue going through um, Route 9 and get to where we're supposed to be. But first, let's take a quick little summary of our Pokemon. We got our boy Toxel. Toxel's revving it up. He's really awesome. Freaking up. So he has the ability Pump Rock. Wait, Punk Rock. I can't speak today. I don't know what it is. But um, it boosts and halves the damage of a uh, sound moves that are done to uh, him and that he dishes out. And he does have two sound moves now, which Overdrive, which is an amazing stab. Punk Rock boosted move, Overdrive, good electric move. He learned Poison Jab, and I got rid of Toxic and I kept Venishock and Poison Jab because he's a very all-around uh, special attack and physical attacker. Um... And then we have Boom Burst now, which is going to be an amazing move for him, especially because Punk Rock, it'll do so much damage. Um, then we have Hatterene as Psychic, the move Psychic, Dazzling Gleam, Dark Pulse, and we have Calm Mind to boost her stats a little bit more. We have our boy Rillaboom, he has Knock Off Wood Hammer Drum Beating, and U Turn. Then we have our boy, our fiery, fiery boy, fire frame, fire wheel, bug bite, crunch, good old Santa scorch. We have Dreadnought. I had Totten Dreadnought, um, Ice Fang, and he now knows Liquidation instead of Waterfall. He had Waterfall, but he learned Liquidation when he leveled up in between episodes, or when she leveled up. I keep freaking such a masculine looking Pokemon, you know? Um, but when she leveled up, she learned, uh, Liquidation, so, there's that. And that's a little bit more powerful than Waterfall. And then, he is still the same old boyo, Corviknight. Yes, nevermore, says the raven. The raven says nevermore. Nevermore! And look, you can see right there in the, in the bottom corner right there, if you, you know, purchase your, uh, go out there and purchase your Pokemon Expansion Pass. It's a really a great deal. You're getting a whole another like, half- two halves of a game it's really cool i like the idea of expansion pass. But we're gonna keep moving through through this route we're gonna get to land we're gonna avoid the clobopus hell out of here clobopus oh god and then a mantine runs right into our freaking faces hello mantine i would love to murder you right now but i'm actually pretty high level Whew. excuse me I had to yawn. I, I, I woke up not that long ago. I wanted to spend an entire day of recording session. Let's fight this lady. Hello, lady. You want to fight me? You got a Toxapex, eh? Toxapex, indeed. You know your Toxapex is going to get wrecked by, uh, by my friend over here. Yeah, this guy. This guy right here. He's gonna, you're going to die. You're gonna die. Your Toxapex is gonna die. I'm walking here, you son of a gun. Oh yeah, go ahead and bunker your barrier, you son of a bitch. You son of a gun. Sorry, I'm being a little off the cuff today. I'm not gonna, I'm not gonna censor myself as much as I usually would. Don't come at me, YouTube. Overdrive is going to kill you. Stop using Braveful Bunker, or whatever the hell that move is called. You son of a... Watch when I hit you with this overdrive, you will die. You can't bunker yourself forever. Do you understand? Now it's done. <laughs> yeah, what do you think about that? Get the hell out of here. So right now, Toxtricity is really, is like really good. Almost all of my Pokemon are super good and really amazing. Um, I'm really happy about a lot of the Pokemon that I have. Well, I'm happy with my entire team. They all have like really good 
I made their movesets really match around their styles. Oh look, now we're in Route 9. Oh, they got a little... There's no grapple locks. No, those are clava poisons. Grapple lock is the, is the one that's being all ugly. What is that? What are you? You're a... Okay. You keep on moving. Don't leave me alone. No, you made me run into this freaking uh, the freaking bergmite. Really, really run into the bergmite. Bergmite, can you can you get the hell out of here? Can you get the hell out of here, bergmite? Why don't you go freaking turn into an avalug? Got ourselves this scopey lens, scopey scopes. I don't know what's going on over there, but I'm gonna ignore it. I'm gonna. Where should we go, people? Where are we going? Okay, we could go that way. Let's uh, fight these guys. You wanna. You mothers wanna. Y'all mother truckers want some of this? Oh, yeah. Who's the music crew, eh? Oh, you have a toxicity, eh? I so happen to have one of those as well. Dude, you're gonna get wrecked. My Pokemons are like, happy as hell. Okay, your Toxtricity is... Both of your Pokemon are super gonna die. Super dead. Both of you, super dead. Goodbye to your Maractus. And then your Toxtricity is gonna hurt me, but Psychic will kill. It will kill. Rillaboom is at level 49. <sighs> Excuse me, I keep yawning. Ouch. Can you not? See, now you're gonna pay for that. She does not like being manhandled. My beautiful little witch does not like being manhandled by especially your toxicity, you dancing, rapping freaking son of a gun over here. Yeah, drop the mic, but not in a good way. Why is she happy? He's all upset, but she's happy. Like, you guys need to work on your relationship here. Ooh, look, a berry tree. We need to get some berries. I'm like literally all out of berries. So we're gonna get all of these berries. And we're gonna fight whatever disgusting creature comes out of this tree. Greedent! God dang you, Greedent. You ugly squirrel. Ugly squirrel! Let's hit Greedent with the Boom Burst. Let's test out how much Boom Burst, how much damage Boom Burst does. Boom! That was good. That was good damage on this this chunk boy. Dead. Get out of here. <laughs> he dropped some berries from his tail. I never I actually never noticed that. Cute little details. I like how Sword and Shield is all, a lot about uh, the cute details. And nobody likes to see the positives. Okay, please leave me alone. Yes. No. I'm not trying to talk to you. Leave me alone. Thank you. Just go on. Got Clavapus! Get out of the way, Clavapus! Freaking Clavapus, man. Get out of here. Get out of here. You know it's weird? Clavapus. Why am I yawning? Oh my gosh, this is the episode of me just yawning forever. Okay, um, what are you people doing? Oh god, there's one of those crack cocaine cops. I can't enter spike myths, so I've just been hanging out here the whole time. No one can challenge a dark type leader like this. <laughs> hey, DTA. Oh, hey, look, it's Marnie. What are you doing over here? <gasps> Marnie! Marnie, you son of a gun. You're a genius! I gotta come grab these things though. Gotta come jack around over here for a fight. Marnie! 
Marnie found us the secret way. I want to see what's in the grass real quick. Oh, it was a good thing I did, because look, there's a Perserker. A wild Perserker is lurking. Do I have a Perserker already? I do. Interesting. I'm gonna run from him, though. Because if we already have one, we're not gonna mess with him. What else can we find in the grass? Aha, Nick it. Nick it. Running. Run. It's not that I'm scared of you. I'm not I'm not scared of you, Thievel. Why did I call it a Nick it? I'm sorry. Um you guys are probably like, oh he's an idiot. <laughs> I meant to say thievil, not nick it. That is evil. Hi, Marnie! I was born here, so I know another way in. If you want to get into town, how about I show you the way? But you're my rival, so I have to beat you first, got it? With pleasure. Uh. There's, uh, here's your homeboys. <laughs> here's your homeboys are with you. <laughs> Team Yell comes out of nowhere. Ooh! Yes. Nice battle against Marnie. Go, Marnie! Marnie, what am I? Go, Marnie! Use your, um, Marnie against, uh, the Marnie. Liopard, eh? Let's use poison jab on the Liopard. Ouch! Do not sucker punch me. Liopard, get out of here. I'm way too over leveled. I hate it. Noise. Sorry, Marnie, we're gonna destroy your team right now. Nevermore has leveled up. You have a Scraggy or a Scrafty? Um. I can stand, I think. Scrafty, that's what it is, yeah. I think I can stand. This might be a terrible idea, but let's, um. Hmm. Poison jab. Let's hit a poison jab. Yes. It did decent damage, and she went for scary face, which is not a uh, not a terribly smart idea. You should have went for it there. Let's kill it with a boom burst. Another scary face, eh? Dude, why didn't you hit me when you had the chance? Like, boom burst is gonna kill you. Punk rock. Get out here. And Toxtricity has leveled up. Toxicroak, eh? Let's switch out. Let's go into my beautiful Hatterene. Hatterene will destroy Toxicroak. Four times effectively. Poison jab will hurt a little bit. Oh, it hurt a lot. What the hell is going on? Is poison effective against? I thought poison was weak to. Oh gosh. What do we do now? Hmm. No, not a good idea. Who do we send in now? I guess Corviknight. Corviknight will have to do. Corviknight's gonna have to drill peck you.
because you are a fighting type. Ouch. Don't sucker punch me. Get out of here. Boo. Oh, Dreadnought almost evolved. Not evolved, what? Leveled up. God, guys, I'm like so tongue twisted and 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 kerfuffled and all this. I'm gonna keep in Nevermore. More Peko, eh? Maybe more Peko. Staying in on more Peko is not a good idea. Um. Well, I can U turn out. Here's a special move I've been waiting for, say, for a special occasion. Spark. Oh, okay. Ouch! That didn't hurt me that much. You turn out. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. Hell yeah. And let's go into Rillaboom and we'll hit another U turn. Rillaboom. Got your drum out. Hey, bro, I don't care how angry you are right now. Or hangry. I don't care how hangry you are. You're s oh. Oh, okay, Marnie. I see how it is. You're still gonna get another U turn. And this one might kill you. I expected much. I expected as much. And you're dead. You hangry little hamster. Get out of here. Hatterene, eh? Why are you dying? Hatterene is really hard to use just due to, um. Sheerly due to the, uh. Speed. Yes. I will not forget. Anyway, I promised I'd show you the way in. Follow me. Well, I can kinda. I kinda gather. Kind of gather for myself that this is the way in, Marnie. Like not a, uh, not trying to be that guy, but uh, ooh, Spike Myth. Nice. Let's hop into the Pokemon Center and heal up our guys and gals. Heal up everybody. Can we buy anything special from the shop here? Nothing that we couldn't buy before. Let's talk to all the Team Yell people that are in here. Okay. Good for you. We're outies. We're out of here now. Let us uh, take a second to explore Spike Myth. Can't go inside this house in Spike Myth? Okay. Wow, I like the... I like the scenery here. With the shutter closed, nobody's gonna be able to challenge the gym. I... I gotta look into this. I just happen to have too many of these, so I'll give you one. Got it? You can handle yourself, right? Piers the card. Okay. Oi! Welcome to Spike Myth, kid. Hope you're ready for the gym mission. Old mate, if you're gonna buy a uniform. If you're looking at a gym leader, straight ahead. Oh. Okay, I guess we're doing the gym challenge right now. <laughs> I guess this is the gym challenge. What the hell happened? Gym challenger. Okay, so we have to fight Team Yell through here. This is kind of cool. They incorporated the they incorporated Team Yell into the gym challenge. That's that's actually really cool. Nice. So, this is going to be a dark type gym. Who are my friends that are going to be most effective against dark types? How do I make could be effective against dark types? 
that will be extremely risky because she will also get hurt by dark types. The bug type moves from Rillaboom, Senta Scorch, and Corviknight will also do some decent damage. Let's keep Toxtricity in here just to get rid of them. It's been a shock them. Night Slash. You can, I avoided it. <laughs> I have bonded and loved my Pokemon, so. They, they will help me with the extra most advantageous maneuvers. Oh, I avoided it again, you son of a gun. Get out of here, Lenoon. You get out of here, ugly team. Team, uh. Team, uh. Yellabala Maha. Super Califragilisticus. Yeah, don't you? Team Yell. Team Yell. That's your name. Team Yell Grunt. You and your Pokemon broke through. I gotta give him, like, a heavy, like, Scottish kind of thing. Oi. Oh, we don't have to fight the other one? Okay. Keep going, I guess. Get jumped by somebody else. Yep, we're gonna get jumped by these people, I assume. No? You guys don't wanna jump me? Oh, God, no. Oh. <laughs> There's... <laughs> There's a Mr. Mime right here! Oh, my God, that's pretty funny. Um, I guess we're going in here. No? Okay. Oh, now, now you want to fight me? Um, yeah, I walked right past you. You didn't, you didn't see me? <laughs> I walked right next to you, lady. I like Team Yell's theme. It's very punk rock. Which is apropos because we have Toxel out here and he's gonna punk rock this thievil. After he night slashes me, of course. Ouch. Yo, that was a crit. You need to do a little better than that. If you're gonna try to crit me, thievil. Get out of here. Ooh, foul play will hurt. Foul play is a really good. Oof. Dark type maneuver. Foul play hurts. Get out of here. Did you only have one Pokemon as well? Yep. Okay. Get out of here. What was that? I heard a big bang out in the living room. My lady must be checking around. Are you done? Are you... You're done... Okay. Thank you. Thank you for moving your mime out of the way. I appreciate that. Hey, look. Oh. I didn't even see you guys up there. Oh, God, they're assassins. <laughs> and they broke those boxes. <laughs> you didn't surprise me, but I, like, did not... Well, you did surprise me, I guess. I guess that's the definition of surprising, huh? There you go, man. Look, both of you guys mashing with the Mohawks. Oh, look, I have a Mohawk, too. What's going on, guys? Freaking Mohawk crew. Bro. Mohawk crew. Hmm. His back hurts. <laughs> Did you see him? He's like, oh, my buck. Oh, my buck. Oh, I'm gonna die. No, Dr. Resident no! My toxic lizard! No! Let's go into Corviknight. Corviknight will kill him. Yeah, put on that pressure, Corviknight. And let's drill him. Let's drill him real nice and real hard. With that drill pick. Thank you, I knew you could do it. I knew you could do it, you son of a gun. Nevermore! Little Boom is now level 50. That was pretty quick. Okay. Well, let us, uh, let's revive and heal, um... 
Get, get out of here. Am I gonna have to fight the other one now? No? He left. Okay. Let's revive and heal our friend. Do I have a full revive? I do. <laughs> yes. Okay, here's what we're gonna do. So everybody has dark types here. Why am I opening the Pokedex? So let's open this. There we go. We're gonna put Santa Scorch in the front. Followed by Corviknight. Because they seem to have like a lot of dark fighting types. Hey look, another Max Revive. I could have used that just now. Pretty funny. Let's keep on moving and let's uh, slowly Somebody's gonna pop out of that. No. Somebody's gonna pop out of this alley. Mr. Mime. Mi Mr. Mime. <laughs> whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh my gosh. They are assassins. Just like those dudes jump out of the window and look at them. Freaking phew, 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 phew. That was some added acrobatics. They had a nice little corkscrew freaking backflip. That was nice. A Weavile, eh? He has a Weavile. It was a good thing I decided to bring Santa Scorch to this fight. Not gonna pressure me. What's gonna do more damage? Fire type move or what's gonna hurt more? Let's bug bite. Ouch. Slashing me with your claws. Ooh, good call on my part there. Good call, good call. Die. Get out. Get out of here. Get out. Get to the chopper now. Yeah, go go do your little flippy thing back. Like, go go back now. Flippy flip the hell out of here. All right. Yep, there, I knew that was going to happen. Get, get gone. Yeah, you go too, you freaking freak. Oh my god, he's so freaky. Has anybody seen Detective Pikachu yet? It's a really good movie. Um, but oh my gosh, that Mr. Mime, man. I think we've done it, guys. I think we're here. Okay, let's go. Whoa. Oh, we're not here. Look, we... Hey. What's going on, man? You're trying to fight me too? Let's do this. Oh gosh. He snuck up on me. Ah, he does <laughs> his whole disguise isn't ready. Look at him. I didn't have time. You. I didn't have right time. <laughs> Look at him. Look at him. He's not ready. Is he wearing his underwear? <laughs> oh no, he's wearing a different little. Uh, he's wearing some underoos. <laughs> he's missing his spikes. He's missing his face paint. Oh my gosh. Unexpected, I tell you. Ooh. Ooh, you boyo. This is gonna be interesting. A bug bite is gonna hurt you. And then a nice old uh, U-turn will also hurt you, but uh... Let's do a drill peck on you. Don't taunt me, I was, I was already gonna attack you, bro. You were already the one I was going for. Oh, you're gonna set spikes. Good thing nobody's switching out. Get out of here. Leopard. Get out of here. Get out. And you are dead. Little Leopard looking like a nice little Cheeto Leopard. Or actually, the Cheeto, Cheeto guy. Chester Cheeto's actually a Cheetah. I don't know why I called him a Leopard. Ooh, Brave Bird. Yes. So Brave Bird, blah, 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 bird. Brave Bird does a lot of damage, and but it does give me recoil. So I think it's a good investment, though. Should we keep Home Claws? Hmm. You know what we're gonna do? 
We're just gonna keep Brave Bird. We're gonna get Brave Bird, and if I decide on it later to change that, then I'm gonna, I'll change that. Cause Brave Bird does do a hell of a lot of uh, of recoil. Let's hit it with a nice flame wheel, and then uh, Steel Wing. I guess that'll us two beating on you will kill you. So there you go. Oh, thank you for the crit. Thank you for the crit, Corbinate. I appreciate it. Now both of you guys get the hell out of here. How come this dude over here isn't pumping his fist? Just because he's not wearing his makeup? He's not allowed to... Ta-ta-ta. Pump his fist or what? He lost all of his energy. Hey, get out of here, dude. You're not even wearing your disguise. Like, get the... Go home. Get ready. Jeez. Underprepared. I want to make sure all of our guys... Eh, he's alright. He's alright. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. Marnie, tell your friends. Shut your gob. Oh, did you... Oh, I'm really sorry. The lot of Smikeman's telling me that they'll lock down the city for my sake. Spike Man's just getting keeps in the door. P.S. Says how he decided to disguise himself as a team yelling sabotage the other challenges. We thought you were. We could stop the other gym challenges, reach the gym, then Miss Marnie would win and make it Champions Cup. Oh, they're trying to sabotage it all so some Marnie can get ahead of everybody. TTX, no need to bother with me all the preparation or whatever. Go on and face the gym leader. Oh, okay. Wow. Okay. I pass up all you guys. I'm gonna assume they have nothing to talk about. Wow. What's this guy doing? What's up, you? Looking for a Pokemon. Pokemon trade. How about you? Your Obstagoon. For my Cantonian, Mr. Mime. No, I don't want a Mr. Mime. Oh, yeah. Oh, he's a rock star. He's not even singing, though. <laughs> you're not even. Bro, bro, it looks like you're singing, but, 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 you're, but you're not singing. They're early into his lip singing. Lip syncing. His hair looks very spiky. Is he a human? Sigh. So you're finally here, huh? See, I'm ready for a JJ Gym Challenger. Oh, I don't like how they all looked at me like that. Figured that's why nobody was coming to challenge me. I got some good ears, so I overheard the whole thing about the city being shut up. When I was alone, I was. it was like my soul was weeping. This is a simple gym stadium. We can't even Dynamax our Pokemon. But well, I still hope you enjoy the battle. Oh, I will, man. We don't need a Dynamax. I'm I'm all I'm all cool, man. So you're a dark type gym challenge. You're dark gym leader, right? I'm the gym leader of Spike Myth. Piers, the dark type user. You want to challenge me, even though you'll lose? Then this song is for you, foolish trainer. Get ready for a mosh pit with me and my party, Smike Myth. It's time to rock! <laughs> you are challenged by Gym Leader Piers. Gym Leader Piers, send out Scrafty. You're pretty much gonna have Team Yell Pokemon, aren't you? Ooh, I like this theme. Everyone cheer on my Pokemon. Let's do it, Scrafty. Intimidate. I got white smoke, bro. You ain't lowering nothing. Hmm. Intriguing. So I actually sent a Scorch was not the right Pokemon for this portion of the battle, but we will send in Corviknight, and Corviknight will brave bird the living hell out of him. 
why I like this uh, kind of metal. Ouch. That hurt. Dude, I'm going to test out Brave Bird on you. You're dead. You are so dead. Boom! Take that. How much... How much recoil am I going to take? That's a hefty amount of damage. It's not too much recoil, though. It's a pretty good glass cannon amount of recoil, though. We're going to keep in... Malamar, eh? Malamar. Psychic Dark Type. Hmm. You turn. Yep. <laughs> did you, uh, did you turn your switch upside down to get that thing, Piers? <laughs> how did, uh, how did they evolve in the wild? That's my question. You just have to, like, flip them upside down and shake them. <laughs> Evolve! <laughs> Evolve, Inke, damn you. I didn't see what Pokemon he said he was sending in, because I was busy shaking. Let's send back in Scorch. Obstagoon. Hmm. What type is Obstagoon? Hmm. Gonna stay in on Obstagoon. Obstagoon. Yeah! You know, Obstagoon is perfect for you, actually. It's like the perfect friend. I think Bug Bite should do a good amount. Obstruct. Is that your, uh, special move there? It's just a way to protect yourself? Oh, it lowers stats, but it won't work on me because I have white smoke. <laughs> what are you going for now, boyo? Throat chop. Ooh, that hurt a little bit. Ooh, Santa Scorch. Didn't do too much. There. Let's risk it. Obstruct, okay. Let's risk it. If I would have known he was going to go for Obstruct again, I would have, uh... I would have healed up. Okay, I was faster this time. Uh, oh no, he lived! Oh no! He's going to kill me now. Counter! Oh jeez. Yep, I died. Thank you, Scorch, for all the hefty damage you've done. Hmm. Huh. Let's see... Going to Dreadnought. Just for the hell of it. Mm, use Ice Fang to put it out of its misery. Done. Get out of here. Dead to your punk rock kiss looking self. Go, uh. I can't think of a kiss song right now. Why can I not? Think of a kiss song right now. Scun tank. Scun tank. I've fought in scun tanks before. Hmm. Should I stay in? With dread. I can stay in with dread now. I think I'll be all right. <laughs> Skuntank is your last Pokemon, eh? I like how your Pokemon are all very stylish. They, they fit you perfectly. Why would you tell me your, uh, your strats there, bro? Will a Rock Tomb kill you? It won't kill you, but it, it hurt you pretty damn good. Toxic, okay, you're gonna poison me.
Okay. Um, let's hit it with an ice fang. If it wants to poison me, I'll try to. I'll try to bite it. Ah, uh, thank you, Dreadnought, for avoiding that. I'm gonna bite it with some icy fangs, and it's dead. Aftermath. Oh no. Well, it doesn't matter anyway, because that was your last Pokemon. That was your last boyo. You've defeated Gym Leader Pierce. <laughs> Depression. Oh, he's like, ugh. I like his, his, I like his very like neon blue eyes. It matches like, it looks like his eyes are literally like those neon lights back there. Give me my badge. Here's your dark badge. Hell yeah. I believe that is the, uh, isn't that the uh, first dark type gym leader ever in Pokemon? I don't think there has been one in the past. I might be wrong, but now I will catch Pokemon up to level 55. And I got the dark uniform. Nice. My little sis Marnie's gonna challenge me next, I bet. That was actually kind of sweet. See, so you were watching, sis. You won't learn nothing seeing me lose. I was watching your battle, bro. That it's how I learned to battle any at all. That's right. Oh wow, they're related. That's cute. I want you to take over the gym here in Spike Myth, as it's your gym leader. Yeah, I know. You plan to retire after the Champion Cup, right? I think. You've really become a great gym leader, even if you don't gigant- Dynamax from on. I love you, but um, my answer is a big fat no. I mean, when I end up becoming champion, I won't be able to be the gym leader. Good point. In that case, let your big bro see if you have the skills to be a champion. Hey DTX, thanks for having my- um, having an amazing Pokemon battle with my brother. It's my turn next, so clear off for a bit, okay? I am. I'm outies. I'm getting the hell out of here. Goodbye. Yeah, give me the, my TM. Snarl! Snarl! That's a terrible TM that you're giving me. Whoa. Hey, man. Hey, there's some trouble. We're in round nine, even the champion. Okay. Yeah. I'll come help you. Just hold on. Just let me let me heal up my Pokemon, all right? No. Bro! I wasn't ready. Told you I wasn't ready. Kaboom! Oh jeez. Leon, what is happening? DTX, thank you for coming. But I've got it all I I've got a handle on this. Whatever make that noise, I'll see to it. I already told you, didn't I? Keep an eye on that goal. On the, on, the, on the winner of the champion. The only gym badge left is the one you'll get from the dragon leader. Dragon. Bleh. I can't talk, man. Dragon leader Ryan, right? Ryan is the only trainer out there I consider a real rival. Okay. And there I go again. Sorry. Yeah, I know. Okay. You're gonna go figure out what that, uh what that was yeah go figure that out man it's coming from the tunnel champion away <laughs> up up and away okay well, I'm gonna come back in here real quick and heal my freaking Pokemon before you start throwing me into more things hell yeah let's go in here and heal up let's heal up everybody yes Yes, yes. No, no, I don't want to do it again. Alrighty, everybody. After all that, we uh, we made our way here in the town that I cannot remember what it's called, and we beat Piers. The, the gym, dark type gym leader. We're gonna head our way to the final gym challenge. We're in Spike Myth. That's what it was. We made our way through Spike Myth. 
We got our Galarian Slowpoke in the beginning of the episode with that nice little thing in the beginning. It's been a long episode. I love you guys, 3000. See you guys in the next one. Goodbye.